Not so Freudian here. Welcome back to Let's Play the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Dailies. Yesterday was just embarrassing. I just couldn't get out of the way of the stupid uh, super troll bomb. And then the odds of getting a crawl space instead of the. <laughs> um. Dang it. Um, door down. I don't know. Alright. Okay, what on earth is going on here? Annoying enemies. I think Maggie actually starts off with the worst damage of any character. Like, I know Kane, Judas, Eve might actually be worse than Maggie. Kane and Judas I know have more. Isaac, I believe, has a little more. Because he only takes six or seven shots to kill a um, grub. Whereas I think Maggie takes eight if she doesn't get any damage upgrades. All freaking Luya. Maggie is slow. Alright. Doubles my damage output. And no drawback the way Tripler Quad Shot have. Still don't see any tinted rocks. And yeah, I know the odds of hitting with both tiers at the same time are lower than hitting with one tier, but the fact that it's since the two tiers are not, uh, what's the word, um, like they aren't centered, you're more likely to hit with one of the two than you are to hit with one out of one, if that makes any kind of sense. Like, because if the enemy's directly in front of you, you're gonna hit with both. And if the enemy's slightly off to a side where you would miss if you only had one shot, it's going to hit if it's not too far off to the side. No bombs, no tinted rocks. Wrong kind of famine. rocks in here either, but it's not like I've got anywhere I can go to get bombs unless I go into the shop and hope that one of the fires has a coin in it, and then pay five cents for a bomb, or a solar for that matter. That was easier than I expected. No tinder rocks in here either. I guess I could go try and buy a soul heart, but I don't think it's going to happen. Burning Basement, Curse of the Lost. Alright, the thing is I really need the Devil Room on this floor. I thought they took four on augmented shots. Burkano, holy crap, I'm going to get hit. Dang it. There's basically no way I was avoiding that. Like, there's just too many enemies. And no... Like, I'm too slow and not enough space to 
not enough power to kill them before they got to me. And of course it was a dead end except for the shop. I did not mean to pick that up. But at this point, thankfully, if I get him in between the two shots, he'll dodge into one of them. <sighs> Son of a crap. Finally got some bombs. Some explosive diarrhea. Doesn't help. Relax doesn't really help. I'd already screwed the pooch on the normal damage. Now I just hope I find another bomb for that. There we go. Alright, so secret room, and then it should just be the room to the left of here. Have tinted rocks in them, right? That room. So yeah, once I find the boss, I come back and blow up all the tinted rocks to go for the, um, like, so I make sure I still have the soul hearts for the boss fight. Because I don't want to lose the soul hearts before I get there. Because that would just be really awful. Looks like you can stand outside of the big shot. Dang it. The rack jacks gives me. I mean, that could be useful. I don't think I've actually been to the item room on this floor yet. So let's head down for that. It's got to be this way because I think I've been everywhere in the upper and lefter areas. Really, that explosive diarrhea was amazing. Two of spades, doubles of keys. I'm not gonna waste my only soul heart on that. Uh, not quite enough money to want to go to the shop. So I'm just gonna go to the next floor. And now, hopefully, I'll get a devil room. And a decent item. Out of the shop. Do -do -do. Alrighty, I can go in this one. Teleport? No teleport. That almost bounced straight into me. Two extra soul hearts is huge. Because remember, every damage upgrade I get, more or less doubles my damage. Or is worth more or less double its theoretical damage upgrade. Because even when I'm not hitting with both, I'm more accurate in general. Because really, small rock isn't a very large damage up 
and I completely blanked on that second one. But yeah, small rock isn't actually a very large damage upgrade. It is, however, doing a whole lot for me. Myself with half a heart. Oh, wait, there's a down direction here. Uh, uh, use a few more luck upgrades, too, if I'm going to be relying on the push pin for my piercing and spectral shots. Money? Almost enough to want to go to the shop. I'm going to need another bomb. Definitely. Because that's a pretty good place to bomb over to. And then... Pick up another, um... Uh, I don't remember what stud finder does. Oh, okay, that room up... Where I started is actually... Right, it's already hard mode. I'll probably buy that. Okay, that room up there is actually a library. Or most likely a library. No, I don't take that. Yeah, that increases the chance of finding crawl spaces. definitely worth coming in for. Just grab that so it doesn't show up later. I need to get rid of those before they make too much creep toward me. One bomb, yes. And a reasonable amount of money. I don't need to go buy the Soul heart. There's the item room. There's that. Wait a minute. Did I not pick up Dr. Fetus a couple days ago when I got host hat? I think that was that run. Where we went down to the chest or shoal or sorry the chest or the dark room and I found Dr. Fetus and wound up not taking it because I didn't want to kill myself with the bombs now that I'm thinking about it the bombs may not have hurt me at all but yeah now if I find Dr. Fetus I'm definitely taking it right, strength could be useful depending on who I fight let's take it in I'll just use it Increases each out of each eye, and it's, and the tears isn't even just there to make up for having picked up quad shot. I had quad shot that same run. I think. I think I'm thinking of the right one. It was the last one I won. Then a couple days of huge embarrassments. A few days of huge embarrassments. I'm not gonna lie on that. like the secret room, but I'm not gonna use my two bombs. Uh, come on. How did I leave that room without grabbing pushpin then? Whatever. 
that's obviously not the super secret room, so let's just go to the caves too. Of course, now that I say that, it's going to be the flooded caves and I'm going to hate it forever. Or not. Come on. Of course, it pops up just where I can't get an angle at him. Okay. Apparently, range is actually an issue. Boss of steel is nice. I'm an idiot. I was about to say, oh, Chariot could be good if I find a blood bank. And then, of course, I remember, hey, wait a minute. Here's a blood bank. Makes me wish I hadn't used the two diamonds yet. Let's just use this. Oops. Whatever. Okay. I... Like, I mean, I obviously intended to dodge that. But I didn't think I was going to come anywhere near actually avoiding that. thing says there's a penny in there. Oh, you know what? I'll bet it's a sticky nickel underneath the machine itself. Oh, that's one of the ones that was invincible to all the others were dead. Soul's great. I'll fight greed. Means I don't fight greed later. Unless, of course, I fight uh, Super Greed. But let's just see if there's anything in here. Tiny arcade, but it's got all the normal stuff in it. Alright, heading down. Post tap fires back sometimes. Need another bomb. Huh. So it does block shots when it does that. Oops. Screw it. I don't wanna have to go over this room again. Does it fire shots that are identical to my shots? They looked a lot bigger than they did last time I had it. There we go. Okay, range is... you know... Oh, I could have gone to that trapper. I'm an idiot. 
Oh well. Screwdriver's gonna go in here now. Okay, get these useful. I've had a lock up. Three bombs is great. I don't think that's balls of steel. It'd be hilarious if it was. Yeah, that dude just could not hit me. Thanks to the soul. Does the soul push them out of the way? I think it totally did. That's interesting. Maybe it pushes all charging enemies out of the way, because it seemed like that was a charge that got, you know... Pushed him out of line. Of course, it also interrupts the charge, so they don't keep going as far past, which is something you gotta watch out for. Back in full health. Oh, I missed a right turn up there already. Dang it. Alright, the two champion chubs is going to be. Just like the battery, it's not necessary right now. It's not even useful right now. Okay, there's the boss. Darn it. I always hope to catch more than one. I like that. But if you didn't catch the other one in its explosion, it just caught it in the... Gives me a double item anyway. I think it always gives a double item. If you re-roll it, it might not be a double item. I'll take this in case it's Krampus. Well. I guess it's not really paranoia if they really are out to get you. into the item room or the shop on this floor. <sighs> Makes me sad that I'm not all that likely to get guppy now. Especially since I accidentally skipped that trap room last floor. Because there was a chance I could have either just gotten a
I can beat a lot of rooms by just standing still now. But yeah. Okay. That leaper has the soul. Or whatever the enemy equivalent is. So my shots were definitely curving around it. What are we close for? Whatever. Oh, hey, Kimpy. Gave me half a heart more than I lost. I'm not really looking for uh, tinted rocks right this instant. Because I already have small rock. I guess I could go could get gold chests out of them. Now that I think about it. Whoa! Tractor beam. Okay. They die. Algis. Algis. I'm just going to use to wreck him. I forgot I could shoot when I used Algis, unlike when you use uh, Unicorn Horn, Unicorn Stump, Chariot. You can't fire. I haven't picked up a speed upgrade, that's why I feel so incredibly slow. Because really, I am incredibly slow. I mean, in the kind of ridiculous way where you're just like, holy crap, please give me the spoon. Actually, that could only happen on Womb 1 now. Or, I'm not actually sure if. I mean, the black Mega Satan logo might mean that we're going down, but I don't know. I don't remember if the color is actually indicative. Hi, Lutvik. Sorry, I need to be able to see what I'm doing, so please don't stand in front of the monitor. Please? And that's why I should have picked up hearts. And why I gotta hope for an arcade or a thing. And don't forget I can go back to it now. Because if it teleports me to a um, devil room, it'll help even if I don't earn a devil room. Because I got one last floor. Ooh, I thought it was through the door. Oh, that works. Two of them. Well, most maybe. Yeah, there's two. Now, after I find the shop, I'm gonna go spend a bunch of money on the fortune teller and hope it gives me um get your butt out of my face. Like that. Um. Cancer, really. I'd hope one of these chests. I really hope you aren't planning on unplugging the internet. Yeah, well, at least I'm recording onto my hard drive. What are you doing? There's nothing back there except cords. Oh, you know what? That's where I tossed. I tossed a blanket back there, and he's decided he wants to sleep on it. That's actually kind of cute. Ace of spades and a penny. Wow, that was completely worthless. I mean, I guess Mom's pearl might be kind of good, but. Uh, uh, I'm hoping for something better. I was just, you know what, screw it, I'll go back for it. Whoa! Okay, my keyboard stopped working for a second, or there was a tractor beam or something, because I could not move at all. Okay, regular Wallmasters. Oh, yeah, 
I forgot about this item actually. This item's cool. Doesn't help on this room. You almost never get hit in this room. But holy crap, Maggie is slow. And so of course this is it's a lot of damage. And the way it interacts with um the man, what's the name of that thing? Actually, I don't need cancer now, do I? Yeah, the way it interacts with Lump of Coal is really helpful. I'll use it. There's a battery I can grab just to... get back to full before I fight the boss if I need to. shot and um, piercing shot or and then this will hopefully make it so any enemies that I mean hopefully if enemies are shooting enough shots that I manage to hit battery baby will absorb the shots and turn them into money or not money batteries Holy crap. I have not gotten nearly enough sleep in the last forever. Stupid work. I will totally take the blood bag. If I get it. It'll kill a demon heart. But, holy crap, I hope the blood bag still gives a speed increase. So I think it did in the original game. Like, not even the birth, but just the Binding of Isaac. Holy crap. That's annoying. I don't have enough bombs to go blow up the other machines or anything. I'll just take this to... stock up. I'll check for a... Um, yeah, not hopefully. A whole chest is what I was saying. Okay. Oh, I'm immune to the foot. I forgot. It's, um... It's, uh... Oh, cool. We are going to the chest, so I get some items for free. No devil room. Yeah, host hat makes you immune to the foot because the foot counts as explosive damage, somehow. Oh. So does it glow immediately, or...? No, it's only when you get a full charge. I shouldn't waste two keys here. Oh my god. That was not a waste of two keys. But holy cow, I'm still slow. Yeah, that really looked like a secret room to me. Key bomb. No. Oh my gosh, I completely forgot about the green of it. I almost walked right over it. Screw fight. Yeah. Okay, catching him with the edge is better. Because he's in it longer. Alright, so I do need to charge for a little bit before I shoot. Good room to test out different ways. Nifty. Dang it. Can't get through the room without 
making that up, so I'll still go to half a heart. Because I might find a um, blood bank. Grab those, because they're useful. Touching battery, baby. Make it drop batteries. I thought it was only shots. Well, now that I say that, I think I've noticed that before. All right, I was hugging the top, and it waited long enough that it could shoot me. I'm not gonna sacrifice because I'm going down that far anyway. So I'm not getting an extra floor or anything out of it. Might as well use that one. Thinking about it. Screwed up, picked up keys and store credit. Doesn't help when there's no more stores. Because unlike credit card, it does not work on and two giant circles of doom. Sign me up. <sighs> Screw it up. It's been a couple of... Screw you, buddy. You're getting blown up so I could have a better chance of getting a double room. charge. The ability to one-shot probably almost any boss if I aim it right. Infested. Infested destroys poop apparently. And he almost killed himself bouncing into the I think I can even get those bombs because I don't think poop makes uh, bridges. I'll try, let's try for a yeah, uh, That was interesting. The laser didn't appear to do any damage at all. And the knives only do damage on the way out instead of the way back. No curse here. Avoid the big room if at all possible. I cannot really trade any trinkets right now. When I have such terrible speed. Alright, so this room is going to have a soul heart for later. Fight in the trap room. Grab the bomb and the 
money. I mean, there's a chance I'll get money equals power. Not a, not a particularly great chance, but it exists. Hoping I'd get teleported to over. Alright. Maybe I'll just die. Lots of health lying around for later. In case I. I mean, I could just walk up to Isaac and melee stab him to death. Probably the fastest way of doing it. I still don't get, like, the logic behind when he's invincible. He's invincible when he has multiple legs on the ground, but not when he's got a single leg on the ground. I mean, when he's got a single leg on the ground, the leg takes damage, and his torso is invisible. Maybe I'll fight Ultra Pride and get uh, nine lives out of it on the next floor. Oops. Something is with the cues got me sad, right? Oh, I already did. Let's just see if that's super secret and it's not. I forgot Mongo Baby just copies another baby you control, but fires twice as quickly. Well, I don't really have any way to dodge that, but the soul deflected all the shots because they have low shot speed. Almost way too slow to get out of the way of them. Is that line across the floor usually there? That was weird. I don't remember that line across the floor usually being there. And that was just an annoying room with weird enemies. Tech X does very little damage. So appar apparently I should just be glad I picked up Mom's knife. Yeah. 
Uh, I'm really hoping to find a Joker card so I can go back to invincibility. Or... I forget the name of it. Is it Missing No? That lets you just, like, keep looping the floor. Because it takes you to an error room and then it'll take you down to... The next floor and everything. Or, it'll, or it tries to take you to the next floor, but since this is, this is the last floor, it just takes you back to here. Alright, that guy gets one shot easy. Then... Not so much. Okay, I don't... I think this fly is just, you know, halfway between... The, I mean, it, it rotates slowly, but distance-wise, I think it's between... Uh, Forever Alone and Distant Admiration. It's... it's Ultra Pride that drops Guppy. Not Sloth. I don't remember what the Sloth drops. Card, apparently. This is definitely the one to take into Mega Satan. It's like, I'll leave the Degas up there for money, or for uh, if I take damage. Because it and the battery are just there in case I take damage. Infested. If I find telepills, I would probably take it, just because there's a chance it... Since when does the enemy drop a chest in here? Giddy gets me killed when I'm ready to go. That was accidental. Hangman isn't going to do anything. Unless there's some enemy that leaves a lot of creep that I don't remember. There's a battery. It's not gonna... Had I taken damage? Crap. I haven't gotten any decent... As it is, Book of Belial, or Book of um, Satanic Bible, whatever it's called, is just going to be an extra piece of HP. Is that? Worst case scenario, I can just walk to the top of the screen and stand still. But I'm really not planning on it. That was fast. Dude. That devil card? Holy crap, I'm doing a lot more damage than I was. Like, I thought it was just a flat increase. But I guess it's a multiplier. Because holy crap. Like, death took four or five times as many shots when I fought it like one room ago. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I'm allergic to the explosions. I was only hitting it once for each phase. I did not mean to do that. I'll tell you that. That was three shots. Holy cow. Not bad placement. Hey, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you would. I will see you guys tomorrow.